Yeah, I agree with it uh, 100%. I think uh, uh, from day one, you know, we've lacked uh, consistency uh, all year, and uh, you know, we've we've let uh, you know huge points slip by um, late in games. You know, to to obviously shootouts, and, uh, um, and we you know we've had some stretches of you know good hockey followed with uh, uh, another same kind of. Stretch of you know not so good hockey and it definitely hurt us uh, uh, you know right now to get into the playoffs. No, I think yeah. it's uh, you know it's really about uh, us you know not uh, uh, playing to our to our potential. Um, you know I think. Uh, no one's going to stand here and, and say that uh, they've had a good year or they've overachieved. Obviously, uh, um, it's 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 a, definitely a down year for for us, and uh, and we didn't get the results uh, because of it. Does it anger you or frustrate you when, as Brad and several other guys are talking about, when we played to the plan, when we did as we were coached? We had that success. We went on that eight one and two run or eight two and one or whatever it was. There were periods of that, but we, for whatever reason, wouldn't stick to that and couldn't sustain that. Yeah, um, I agree to that. Um, you know, we um, parts of it. You know, we've seen a lot of games also this year that we've played some uh, some good hockey that we've followed the system. We've played uh, uh, with the urgency that we should have, and uh, uh, and we got uh, the outcome that. Uh, that we've wanted, so um, it was pretty obvious uh, um, in the games that uh, we didn't. But uh, you know, um, it was really based on the fact that uh, uh, we weren't, you know, and no one was really uh, playing their game, and then and no one was uh, following uh, uh, the game plan. Why do you think uh, there was maybe more straying from the system this year than, than we'd seen in the past? Was it bringing in and rolling in some of the younger players? Was it you know some of the players that? You were missing that you'd had in years past. Is there anything you can sort of put your finger on and say these are the reasons why this happened? Yeah, I mean, I think it's hard to put a finger on on, on the reason why. Um, you know, yeah, definitely at the beginning of the year, the injuries didn't help. Um, you know, bringing in a lot of new faces, and and you know, uh, it's definitely a, um, it, it was for them a, a different system, and you know, we had to adjust to all of that. But it, it'd be unfair to put the blame on on them, and uh, uh, it's definitely. Uh, on, on all of us, I don't think it's. Uh, I can really uh, pinpoint one thing. Um, you know, when you have a, a team, and I, I felt confident, you know, starting in the year with the team that we had, uh, you have to do the job. It doesn't matter who's who's in, who's out. Uh, you just have to, you know, show up and, and do the job and and uh, step up as a player. It's frustrating as a leader that maybe there were tough times this year where there were passengers where there shouldn't have been, or there were guys. Not playing in the system where there shouldn't have been. I mean, is that something that was, was tough to deal with? Yeah, I mean, it, it was frustrating for for everyone. I think that uh, we were all uh, not playing uh, uh, to our full potential. Uh, it's always frustrating to see that, and uh, uh, you know, it's something that we've tried we've tried to fix uh, all year. But you know, it was working only for for a few uh, few games, and then uh, going back. Uh, going back down so uh, you know like I said consistency has been uh, a huge issue uh, this year and the reason why and um, and the fact that uh, you know we've um, no one's really uh, performed to, to their full potential and and you know you can't win uh, when that happens change always happens Bergy but on any roster after every season how much do you want to see this room though stay together the guys in this room stay yeah, together I, I do I mean I, I I believe in this in this group um, you know I I, I hope uh, um, uh, you know, it stays the same at the same time. Uh, we understand the situation. We understand that uh, it is a business, and uh, bottom line is, uh, you know, uh, you have to win, um, especially uh, in a city like Boston, and uh, which is, you know, which is a great thing, I think, and it's uh, definitely uh, always challenges you with, uh, with all the other sports, but also with the fans, and uh, you know, um, we'll see what happens. I mean, it's out of our control as players, and and. Um, Bottom line is we have to regroup and uh, uh, come back a lot stronger next year.